What's the most turtles you've ever seen on this beach? Yeah, the largest arubata we have estimated is roughly about 400,000. And that lasted uh, for about five, six nights. It's a remarkable event. It's something wonderful to see. Sea turtles are just beautiful animals to observe. They are very gentle animals. They are ancient animals. They have been on Earth for millions of years. I've watched many arubatas, hundreds of thousands of animals. Every time is just a beautiful, natural spectacle to observe. Scientists can't yet predict when an arabata will happen or how big it will be. But Vanessa Bezzi is making some surprising new discoveries about the number of turtles in the ocean just off Ostianal. And she's doing it using a new high-tech tool. I've used drones in my own work, but today the wind is a challenge. It's really struggling. There's no way to count all the turtles gathering offshore using a boat. So Vanessa is using a camera drone instead. Soaring 130 feet above the sea, the drone follows a set route for almost three miles, enabling Vanessa to count the turtles. And the numbers she's revealed are staggering. Over the year-long study, I flew over 500 different flights. And in that time, we counted and observed over 22,000 turtles at the surface of the water. That might sound like a lot of turtles, but Vanessa isn't convinced she's seeing them all. Sea turtles are reptiles and must surface to breathe, but they can also spend a fair bit of time underwater. To get an accurate count, Vanessa needs to find out how much time they spend below the surface, where the drone can't see them. So she heads out to sea with a different kind of camera, an underwater GoPro she'll attach to an Olive Ridley. But first, they need to catch a female. No easy job, since Olive Ridleys can weigh over 100 pounds. Once the turtle is on board, Vanessa attaches the camera gear. The camera will fall off in two or three hours, then float to the surface, emitting a radio signal Vanessa can use to retrieve it. The hunt for the camera takes more than an hour, but Vanessa finally homes in on a signal. There it is! Woo! It was far away, but we found it! Woo Once she has it in hand, it's pretty clear where the turtles spend most of their time. This female's underwater dives lasted up to 28 minutes. While her maximum time at the surface in view of the drone was just one minute, 40 seconds. Being on the boat, I was always under the impression they're kind of hanging out up there for hours, but really it's, it's not that long at all. Using the underwater data, Vanessa now estimates that the drone is seeing only 17% of the turtles at Ostianau. Thousands more are likely hidden beneath the water. 